Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Sokka wasn't killed off in the Legend of Korra. He died sometime before the events of the show. He was alive for Korra's birth but never lived to see her master the elements. The show needed to show the new team avatar solving problems and going through life on their own. Take our lead! Let's help you make your mark! Maya is Zuko's most consistent romantic interest. One of Azula's only friends, she accompanies Azula on her hunt for Zuko and Iroh. She eventually helps bring down the Earth Kingdom and, when Zuko is given the credit for Aang's defeat, is able to fully enter a relationship with the restored prince. Make your mark! Take our lead! At Norik 1337 agreed, only Jin that girl went on a date with entails from Boss Sing Se, or Suki could be Azumi's mom. Mai ain't an option because she broke up with Zuko in the comics unless they get back together again. Azumi's mother is Zuko's honor. After all Suki married Sokka, and they didn't have any children. Take our lead! Let's help you make your mark! So when you left this world, her father would have had to pass the chief tanship to one of his nephews or something, one of Yu's cousins. This man would have been Tonrak's father, Korra's grandfather, which makes Yu and Korra first cousins twice removed. Korra is a distant cousin of the moon. Thank you for watching! Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.